Okay, everybody, listen up, please. That works so much better. Thank you. Okay. I got several people I'd like to acknowledge before the evening's over, but uh, uh, Mike Noss is here and, and uh, he's running for uh, State Senate, uh, 19th District. He's been a really good friend of gun owners. Uh, Uh, I just want to tell you a quick story. For those of you who know me, uh, my last six years in the state police, I became a post commander. My boyhood dream came true, being a post commander at my local post in my hometown. And one of the official duties you get to have as a post commander is you get to sit on the local gun board. Now, if you remember history, and I know a lot of you have been in front of those gun boards prior to the time I got there as a post commander, uh, the post previous post commander, uh, was always the no vote on the. I walked into the first meeting, you know how you have a little organizational meeting before we actually officially got started. And I said, I just have one thing to say. I just want everybody to know that I am now the liberal of the gun board. I Meaning I'm going to vote for every gun permit that comes in front of us, along, you know, that uh, for law abiding citizens and allow them the right to be able to carry and bear arms and protect yourself and protect us, the citizenry. I followed through with that. I don't think I ever voted against one, if I remember right, in the uh, six years I was post commander. And I think that's where we turned Calhoun County around and we started honoring your service and what you do by being law-abiding citizens and doing the right things. And if I, or when I get to the Senate, I'll do everything I can to get rid of those restrictions that don't allow you to carry in certain places, where if you're law-abiding, you should be able to carry. So that's right. I appreciate it. I gotta tell you this, being former law enforcement, I think that carries a little bit more weight with other uh, senators up there because I think I know the issue of crime and I can tell them and will tell them when you go into private caucus, listen, a criminal doesn't have to go to anybody to buy a stolen registered handgun or unregistered handgun and use it any place, anytime, anywhere they like. And we need, because we as police officers can't be everywhere, we need people helping us keep the peace in our communities and keeping our communities safe where we live, work, and play. And that's why I'll support you and do everything I can to make sure your rights are not inhibited and you're able to be able to carry lawfully anywhere you want in the state of Michigan. Thank you very much.